Hello everybody, welcome to another edition of my weight loss journey. Today, uh, we get to bring you back, we'll start with day 191. Uh, on day 191, it was month one, day 23 of the V-Shred Big Arms program. And on that day, it was leg day. Uh, we have certain separate days than just arms. Uh, with two rest days in a week and we have legs and we also have shoulders um, we have chest and then those routines uh, are taken from the ripped and nighty program from v shred as well so we have a really good mix and variety that you're not just working one muscle group but you're working multiples uh, and giving that time to rest uh, for the ones that you did work so on this day 191 we worked legs uh, the weight uh, did not change uh, for me, so it was 327.8 was my current weight on that day. And uh, following our V-Shred meal plan as well, uh, which is very important. So uh, leg day with that program is probably not one of my favorites, but something that's great, that you feel great uh, when you're done. And it's a little bit of a quicker workout um, than some of the most uh, intense heavy arm days or light arm days. Uh, but it gives it a nice balance, a nice break. Uh, so now today, uh, we get to fast forward today. I believe it's 783 today uh, of my current weight loss journey. And today for me was light arms. Uh, got up early uh, before work today and went to the gym. Uh, got my routine and went to work. Uh, was nice. Went to um, Gators baseball game. Congratulations to the Tigers on their great win, 20 to 7 tonight against Egan. So nice work, boys. Uh, but it was nice to then go from work, baseball game, uh, come home and have dinner, uh, and not have to worry about going to the gym because we would probably be recording live from outside of the car, getting ready to go into the gym. And I'm excited to just relax, uh, get to watch some TV, and then do it all again tomorrow. Um, today was my weigh-in day uh, for um, this week, 783. And on this day for me, I gained with my carb cycling 2.4 pounds, uh, which bring my, brought my weight to 214 today. Uh, I'll talk about kind of what I want to do today and discuss. Uh, but I saw that this morning at 2.14, uh, which then when I put my numbers together, uh, I'm still down 0.4 from last week. Uh, and, and obviously still following my, my meal plan, uh, which I love and I love prepping it and being able to bring it with me to work and have it in a truck all day. Uh, it's really nice and especially very convenient where you don't have to worry about it. You don't have to wonder when you can stop and go and have lunch or uh, really something that really makes it easy uh, as long as you're planning. And that was been our reoccurring theme was, you know, planning ahead. So um, today for me, I think uh, it was harder to see 214 with losing uh, a lot more during the week. Uh, but I want to make sure and I think what I want to touch on and let everyone know that, you know, it's, what is it, two steps forward, one step back, right? So you're going to have the fluctuation. You're going to have moments uh, where your body is just reacting differently. And you're going to have, I've had... Um, I think just about a handful only of gains other than the bulk program through my whole journey. And I think it's the biggest thing is not letting that discourage you. Um, not wanting to give up. Not just saying, well, here we go. And then, you know, we either find food to comfort us or whatever we do to, to do that mentally. And I think you just have to stay strong and use that for motivation 
and know that if you continue to keep on doing the right things, uh, you'll get to exactly where you need to be. So uh, if you've had things change in the past or weight come back on or, you know, feel like, you know, something's not right or you're discouraged, um, don't look at it as a failure. Uh, look at it as a challenge and continue to focus on you and working on what you need to in the end result uh, will still be there in the end as long as you're doing all the right things and you'll get out exactly what you put in. So don't forget about that. Use those pieces for challenges and go out there and fuel your new healthy you. I hope that all of you are having a great week so far. Uh, Wednesday, I didn't realize today, well, it was Wednesday already. Uh, enjoy the rest of your week. I will be back tomorrow to let you know of how our journey continues. Uh, from back in 2020 to 2022. I appreciate all your support. And we'll be giving you details tomorrow on how to enter for the next giveaway on Friday. Thank you very much. I appreciate all of you. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you soon. Be kind.